This male feral cat with the slight limp in the right rear marks his territory on a saw palmetto tree at the main trail intersection. But he is no longer the top cat. A new bigger and stronger male feral cat is on his territory. This new fellow looks almost like a Maine coon cat. Here are the two male cats at the same major trail intersection in the thick Florida forest where I have the camera. The new male is on the left. The male I have been watching for some time is on the right. This intersection is like the town square where a lot of drama plays out. These are true feral cats, descended from feral cats. Their behavior is not typical of habituated animals feeding around houses and people. This is their world. The cats are in the same place just 15 minutes apart around 1 a.m. These are nocturnal cats for the most part. The older cat on the right injured his right rear hip in a fight with a raccoon and while left with a limp is getting around okay. The new male makes his mark with a profuse spray of urine on the palmetto tree at the entrance to the main trail, which is a marker for all wild animals including apex predators, the bobcats, and coyotes. In this close-up, the urine can be seen glistening in the IR lights. This marking and intense smelling of this important area is part of the feral cat's social network. And now a big female feral cat is on the scene. There has been tremendous loss of green space nearby due to rapid development recently, and more animals are showing up in remaining wild spaces. These two male feral cats have their own rituals for sorting out relationships and personal spaces. This video is shown at real speed. The big new feral cat is purposely walking very, very slowly and methodically taking his good old time while smacking his lips. While the original feral male watches and growls right next to the camera, and then follows him into the main trail entrance. But there is no fight. The new big cat is confident and cool. The two appear to have come to terms as the injured older male accepts his place and can be seen following behind the dominant male by quite a few minutes now, fairly often.
All of the urine spraying has attracted the attention of the big female, who slowly and intensely studies the scents. It's only a matter of time before a relationship blossoms at the town square. I'm no expert in wildcat behavior, so I'll let the viewer enjoy the seven minute interaction that follows without comment. The male spent four minutes cooling his heels while waiting for the female to return, so I fast-forwarded through that. 